Wednesday morning. That means we are playing two truths and a lie. Two of us are going to be telling you a true story. No lies, but there is one liar around here. Can you tell who it is? We are currently live streaming on our Facebook page. If you want to check that out, maybe get some facial cues. Maybe someone looks a certain way when they lie. Maybe you can figure it out that way. Otherwise, we're getting ready to do it. We have predetermined who is doing what. Have you guys looked at your papers yet? Yes, you guys. Okay. Yes. Okay. I'm good to go. All right. Let's get things started. You know what? I will start today. Ooh, okay. Uh, Mercedes, you 30 seconds. Uh, once that 30 seconds is up, wrap-up music will start playing, and then we can ask you some questions. You ready? I am ready. Starts now. Okay. Uh, if you've been listening for a while, you know that one of my first jobs was a mannequin model. I used to stand like a mannequin at a department store called Jocelyn's, and we would just stand there in the clothes and pretend we were mannequins. But also part of that job was doing runway modeling fashion shows and I had to learn the entire Vogue Madonna dance because we did that for one of our fashion shows. So I know the whole Vogue Madonna dance because of my job as a a department store (laughs) model. No! No! <laughs> now we have to see it. Yeah, we poke holes in this now or later. My gosh, this is amazing. No way. Yeah, yep, yep. I mean, obviously, I can't d- confirm or deny it right now yeah, with the actions. Yeah. But yeah, ask me, ask me anything. If have you, you ever thought? Because we played that song many times on this radio station since uh, you started working here. Have you ever thought about busting out the actual dance itself? I, I sometimes I catch myself doing it, or if not actually busting it out in my mind i'm like oh this is the part Duh, come on oh, did your body yeah so that's like my claim to fame um and i it's it's on a it's on a videotape somewhere i know it's on a videotape because i remember my mom recording it with our camcorder i was very excited i watched it over and over just to see how i did i'm trying to think you said it's from the music video well, we do like a dance, like a whole. It's a whole yeah, there's it's, a, it's a Vogue dance. dance. Okay, yeah. Yeah, okay. And I'm trying. Well, I'm thinking of the music video since I'm a dancer. I feel like I could remember the dance, but for some reason, all I think of is just people posing, posing. That that's posing. at the beginning. Strike a pose, and that we did okay. that. Strike a pose, and then we all had to pose. Strike a pose, and then when the music started, that's when we started walking. But then when she sings the chorus, "Come on, Vogue," we all had to choreographed to the dance and no. we had a choreographer come in and teach it to us and everything this what? is pretty brazen of you this is a lie to be lying about a dance <laughs> to a dancer Steph is a dancer yeah that's a lot of guts that's yeah. a lot of guts okay uh-huh. there you go wait how long did it take you to, to nail this thing this routine oh it took us weeks we we I'd say at least four weeks we had to go in and practice and because we had to incorporate our runway walks in with it. Oh, so, it's a double yeah, trouble then. It was a whole thing. Wow. Last question, last question. Yes, okay. yes, yes. Did you actually dance at a studio or did they just come into the, the store? They came into the store and there oh, was a okay. an upstairs like room that they cleared out and we practiced there. And this yeah. was at Mervyn's? No, it was at Jocelyn's. <laughs> <laughs> you trying to catch me at Mervyn's? <laughs> Try to get a hole in the story. Jocelyn. That's interesting. Wow. So, so there you go. That is my story. Is oh. it the truth or is it a lie? You be the judge. Who's up next? I'll go next. Okay. Let me uh, bring this music bed down here and um, speak. I'll start my clock. It starts now. Speaking of videos, I have something that's on video. I kind of mentioned this yesterday, but I'll give more details of it. I am actually on a set of workout videos. It's called the Two Minute Workout. And it was filmed here in Las Vegas, I'd say 2007 or 2008. Because I mentioned I don't like doing burpees. The reason being is I did burpees on this video and I didn't, I, my stuff was bouncing around. But this was a whole video series. It was a two-minute workout. He worked out with bands. And the guy that owned it, the instructor, was in the front leading everybody to watch these videos. And I was like one of the uh, workout people in the background following along. So I am in a workout video. In a set of them? Or? Yeah, there's like a set of 10 videos that he put out. And you're in all 10 of them? Yeah, yeah, doing all these different exercises. Mm-hmm. Well, you were like the assistant in the background? Like we would follow you if I was no, watching No, he would, he would he was leading everything. I forget okay. the guy's name, but he was like, okay, grab your bands and you do this. And I we would just be following along in the background. So we were kind of like his, I guess you could say background dancers, but background workouters. <laughs> so we'd be doing all the moves. He's doing burpees. I'm in the background and this other girl and other guy were doing burpees as well. Where did you guys record this? It was a studio on, gosh. Uh, in, gosh, I can't remember. No, it was, like, it was on industrial. <laughs> <laughs> it was on uh, industrial, right there behind the strip. So uh, were you like the guy, because there's always one that modifies for the workout. <laughs> were you the modifier or were you the do it 
full force. No, I followed his lead. I, yeah, no, I did. I did. I, we, I went through the motions. He was a, he was a client of the radio station. That's how I got involved. So he he bought an ad campaign at the radio station, and and I went down. And I, that's how I got tied into the guy. Why did you not ever tell us this before? I I think I may have to- told you when I was doing it in 07 or eight, and I just kind of forgot about it. It's life goes on. You forget about your these claim things. to fame. Wow, look at you. Both They're of out you guys. there. I tried looking this morning to see if I can find him. I couldn't find him. But the guy, I don't, I'm not sure if he still lives in Las Vegas or not. But you don't remember his name? I don't. I'm I'm sorry. I don't. Super nice dude. I just I forget his name. Mm. Liar. <laughs> <laughs> is JC telling the truth or is he lying? Maybe he's listening and calling or someone remembers the guy's name. Super oh. cool dude. Oh. Maybe Scott. I don't know. Maybe Scott. <laughs> <laughs> Doesn't care. Scott with the two-minute workout videos. There you go. Oh. All right. So you be the judge. Is JC telling the truth or is this a lie? Uh, Steph, you're up. All right. You ready? Give me the, the, the countdown. Yes. Right, Steph, your clock. It starts now. I mistook a mistaken an old coworker. For Steve Carell. Back in San Diego, there was a guy on our sports station while I was on the street team, brand spanking new. His name was also Steve. So we were at a remote. It was actually the Chargers game. They broadcasted right before. They did the pre-games. And they said, hey, look, Steve's here. So go ahead and meet him. So I went to go meet him. And I was like, oh, my God, this is Steve Carell. But I did it. I didn't say anything. I didn't want to, you know, oh, my gosh, it's Steve Carell. But it looks exactly like him. It just ended up being his first name was also Steve, but his last name is Hartman. Steve Hartman, the news guy. Yes. I, the I, sports guy. What yes. a sports name, too. Hi, Steve I'm Steve Hortis. Hartman, San yeah. Diego Sports. But then I, I got to show you guys the picture because he seriously looks exactly like Steve Carell. And I thought I was working with Steve Carell for at least 30 minutes. Um, how do I share? <laughs> I swear to you. What, I, I want to know what hit you that it was not Steve Carell. Did you say something to him about his uh, his work? N- no, I actually. Oh look my at this god! Guy. If do you see it, wait, no, I can't see it. Can't see it. She just put it up. Uh, it's gone now. I it's gone. For a second. There you go. Is. Tell me that doesn't look like Steve Carell. <laughs> that totally looks like Steve Carell. Um, we're uh, if you're it on looks our like live Steve stream Carell. right now. Screenshot though you took back in April. No, that's you... today. I screenshotted it today to make oh, sure five, that four. I had okay, proof. Okay, five four. Okay. Uh huh. This was quickly on his... putting this together <laughs> as you're doing two truths and lies. Google men that look like Steve Carell. <laughs> <laughs> or look up Steve Hartman from um, Extra thirteen sixty. He there is San Diego Sports Station. So I, I really quick. I just I I finally realized that it wasn't Steve Carell when they started the broadcast. I was like, hey, it's Steve Hartman, and I'm so and so. I'm like. Oh my God! I thought I was working with Steve Carell for at least thirty minutes. <laughs> it Mercedes, was so funny. I, I think she's lying because she's stealing this of a story that you had, which was a truth. I remember when uh, who was the the Raiders quarterback that was here in the building, and you thought it was Julio Iglesias. <laughs> Jim Plunkett. Jim Plunkett was walking around Mercedes. I think Holy Iglesias is in the building. Shut up, Eugene. <laughs> <laughs> I didn't know Raiders football from back in the day. This was 15 I, years ago. Yeah, he was like an older quarterback. And someone said, oh, there's someone famous in the building. And I kind of looked. I'm like, oh, is that Julio Iglesias? They're Look like, at that. That is Steve Carell. <laughs> Come on. Well, let me show you my screenshot of Jim Plunkett. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Who is telling the truth and who is oh, lying? I love it. 702 364 9400. Two of us are truth tellers. One is telling a lie. You can call us or you can text us. Let us know what you think. Uh, someone just texted, I hope Mercedes is telling the truth. That would be so awesome. Oh, yeah. You just want to see my sweet moves, don't you? Uh, Susie says Mercedes is lying on this one. Uh, this one says JC has to be lying. Otherwise, we would have heard this story a million times. Maybe we did. Maybe we all forgot. I don't know. We tuned him out. Yeah. Uh, This one says, well, JC, you did mention yesterday that you were in workout videos when you were talking about being self-conscious of doing burpees. I do recall that. Uh, Tammy says, I say JC is lying on this one. Frank says, Steph went as far as to get picks. I have to say JC is the liar. He went with yesterday's story (laughs) of his junk falling out. (laughs) All right. Let's do the big reveal. Truth teller. Number one. It is I, the workout star back in 2007, 2008. Oh, my gosh. It's all a blur. Yeah, it was, it was a client of the radio station. He had exercise bands. It was a whole thing. You get a workout in two minutes. We went down to his studio. It was, an, on, it was on industrial, a little warehouse thing. And we shot these videos, and he, he ran an ad campaign on the radio station. And it was, it was a whole thing. And, yeah, I'm out there. I, I did co- try Googling it this morning. I couldn't find him, though. 
I forget the guy's name. Oh, I can help that's the guy's so sad. Name. That's so sad. I know. So you don't do the two-minute workout anymore. I don't. <laughs> <laughs> it was a good workout, though. It was extra resistance bands is what we were using back in the day. But, yeah, I'm out there. The videos went out. They're out there somewhere. So if anyone has one. I'm on there in the background. Oh my god. Doing gosh. burpees with my stuff bouncing up and down. <laughs> oh, no one wants to see that. Yeah, we're good. We're glad <laughs> maybe we can't find those videos. Mercedes, maybe that's why the video campaign failed. Yeah. Like, what is that in the oh. background? I Close. thought you said resistance bands. You put them in your <laughs> put them in your por- in, in your shorts too. <laughs> All right. Truth teller number two. It's me. What? No. Uh, no, no, I know no, 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 no. We got to see proof, Mercedes. All these years. We we've talked need. about stuff you know, and you've never I've once. I've never told you that? Ne- As you're saying this, I'm like, oh my like God. I can call her out right now because she's never mentioned this. Why wouldn't she not have mentioned this? I, I need to find the video because there is the video of us doing it. But yeah, we, we all had to learn the Vogue dance. Um, can you do any of it now? Come on, Mercedes. Do you have the music? Of course. Oh, whoa, sure. You know what up, Steph? Put yeah, it it's there. already loaded up. Okay. Right okay. In, yeah. Is it the hook or what? What are we? You we the got hook? the hook. Do you want the song? What do you want? Uh, just the hook because the beginning part was walking the runway and stuff. It, when when it comes to the chorus. Okay. Ready? Oh gosh. Here we go. That's, that, that's basically all I remember. Dang! <laughs> oh my gosh! That you is killed gold. It. That is you gold. Turn around and we had to do like this thing with our hands, like this, and I, and then yeah, it was it was a whole thing. But yeah, that is the move. I remember the choreo now. <laughs> oh my gosh, that is We're spot singing. on. I gotta learn it from you. <laughs> wow, <laughs> take a bow, you. take a bow. Another Madonna song she knows. Take a bow. <laughs> <laughs> and that means Steph is a liar. Steph. <laughs> hey, okay, so he did work there. Steve I, girl? You know, Steve Hartman worked at the <laughs> station. And I just, every time I saw him, I'm like, oh my God, it's Steve Carell. I'm working with Steve Carell. But I knew it wasn't Steve Carell. It just looked exactly like him. I love how you got the screenshot to further your case. <laughs> that, that was brilliant. I needed a visual. I needed a visual. <laughs> <laughs> oh my gosh, that was a great one. I love that. That was so funny. That was a lot of fun. Uh, learned a lot about everyone on the show today. We do two truths and a lie every single Wednesday morning.